I did the the first or the one hour and then the 8,100 gallons and the 6,300 6, gallons in the two hours and then I put those in the ordered pairs and then I did y2 subtract y1 over x2 subtract x1 and then I did I got negative 1800 and then over 1 so then it would be negative 1 Does that make sense? Yeah. Is there any information in the problem that could also reveal the slope? Um, Either in the context or... I guess just like how much water is being lost per hour. Okay. Does it tell you how much water is being drained? So did you just confirm that? Yes. Cool. So sometimes we can find the slope looking at the graph, looking at two points, as Jessica said, the ordered pairs, or even reading it in the scenario. Does that make sense? Awesome. Good job, team. Thank you.